What's going on guys, it is me, Graceful Theory, and today I'm bringing you the guide on how to make the Fire Staff in Black Ops 2 DLC Origins. So basically we're going to want to find the, uh, the red vinyl first. Um, basically it's going to be down in the uh, ice cave. If it's not spawning here, it doesn't look like it right now. It's going to be up on a little box near Generator 6, or it's going to be inside the church, which I will show you right now. So you'll actually see it just right here on this bench right here that's on fire. Um, that is the first part we're going to grab. The second part, you're going to see a, a glowing plane flying around in the sky. Go ahead and shoot that down. I've noticed that it does spawn around round five or so. And the part is always going to fall in the same spot. So you'll kind of see it fall out of the sky right here between generator four and at the bottom of the excavation site. Now the next part we're going to get is usually around eight. The uh, big guy is going to come. He's going to spawn. Just get on the tank. This is the easiest way to kill him. He will glitch. Um, basically, he's uh, going to leave right now. And then he's going to meet us all the way down at the bottom to where the tank has a cooldown period. Um, but this this is by far the easiest way to kill him. That way you don't have to, you know, be running around the map with him chasing you, risk getting killed by him. And you'll also get an easy part from him as well. So we're going to go ahead and wait here for the uh, tank to cool down, defend ourselves. And then you'll see right here that he is stuck. Now I do have a friend that kind of jumped off to kill him and it, it did actually cause him to uh, start shooting back. But normally if all four of us or you know just two of you or however many people you're playing with are staying on the tank, he won't move at all. It'll be an easy kill for you guys. And you can see it actually takes me a couple hits um, from the back of his head here. He does have a lot of armor on him. However, if you shoot him a couple times in the face, he's really easy to take down. Uh, especially this early in the rounds. So you'll see that little part right there. Go ahead and grab that. That's the second part for the fire staff. And then we're going to go ahead and get back on the tank. And then head up to the uh, top of the church or to generator 6 to grab the uh, the third and uh, almost last part for the fire staff. So go ahead and activate this generator. You're then going to just hold it off until it's finished and then I'll show you where the uh, third part is going to be spawning at. Alright, so it looks like we went ahead and uh, captured that generator. Then you're going to see on the right hand side here at that box that the last part, uh, or the top piece of the fire staff does come out. The next step, go ahead and make your way down to the fire tunnel which is located by generator 3 there. Go ahead and put your music player at the bottom of the cave to activate the uh, portal. And then basically once this is done, we're just going to head through and grab the very last part to craft the fire staff, which is going to be the uh, fire gem here, or the red gem. So go ahead and pick that up right here, and then make your way back and start building the portal to head back through to uh, go to the Pack-a-Punch area to just finish building the uh, staff. So very easy to get these parts. You'll notice that they're all kind of within the same general area of the map. Uh, you don't have to be running around too much. Basically just shoot the plane out of the sky, kill the big guy down at the bottom of where the tank uh, cools down, and then finally just activate generator 6. So go ahead and make your way down here to the bottom of uh, Pack-a-Punch. If you haven't already opened this chamber, just put the uh, music player right there on the right hand side of the table. And that is basically it guys, so really easy tutorial. Um, the staffs are pretty easy, I've noticed so far, you just want to grab all the parts. I'll start crafting it for you and kind of show you a demonstration of what it does. If you did like the video, guys, go ahead and drop a like below. I really appreciate all the support. And basically, until next time, guys, I will see you guys again soon. All right, take care. Peace.